Uh, good day everyone, John here. This is my um, small CNC lathe. That's a Boxford 125 TCL. It's been substantially modified. And what I'm videoing today is making some small parts um, for my Armstrong model cannon. And these are the uh, axles for the carriage. There's 20 of these on each cannon, and um, that's 5mm stainless steel axle with brass end caps. And you can see, it, it, the reason I'm sticking my hands here is to make this bloody camera focus, that, uh, that that end cap is about 12 and a bit millimetres in diameter and I'm drilling two holes concentric uh, about, at about uh, eight millimetres diameter and then milling into the central protuberance um, a bit of a relief for the head of the retaining bolts which hold these on. Okay, so I've got one mounted up in the chuck That is the milling attachment attached to the tool post of the lathe. Um, and the little brass bit in the distance in the chuck there is the part which I'm going to attempt to do that drilling and milling process on. If I can get this straightened up. God, this camera's frustrating. Right. So. We'll turn on the tool post milling attachment. That's got a 1.6 mil drill in it. Get it into position. Now I'm going to send the instruction for the chuck to rotate around 180 degrees. Drill the other hole. Now I'm going to um, put a milling piece in, in this chuck, so I'll turn the camera off while I get that ready. Right, now I've mounted a 4mm four flute end mill. I haven't touched this, this chuck or the piece that we drilled the holes through a moment ago. So now I'm going to start up this again and I'm, I'm going to run this down. The camera's fine in every respect except for the autofocus. It's so slow, it's ridiculous. So you can see, I mean this is a pretty tiny part and it's done that job really very neatly. Very happy with that. Okay, so I'm going to turn this off now. I've got another 23 or so to go. And I'll show you the end result when I've finished.